What's up guys? Hi, it's me again. Welcome back to my channel. So we'll be making something out of canned sardines because canned sardines are not only sustainable, they're also portable and affordable. I'm not so sure if it's really affordable because I usually see them in the supermarkets and they're usually in the import section and they're kind of expensive. This one, I love it, but this is from my friend from Uzbekistan. Imported. Expensive. But I found a solution. I asked the shop downstairs if they are selling sardines in tomato sauce. Yes, so I'm in luck. They are selling sardines in tomato sauce. So today I'm going to show you a very simple recipe for 10 RMB. If you're looking for some keto snacks to stash, or your next to go to recipe, look no further. Superfood sardines is where it's at. But this recipe is not keto. But what I'm saying is that sardines are also good for those who are into keto diet. I'm not into keto diet, I'm just on a seafood diet. Whenever I see food, I eat. So if you're new to this channel, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell notification so you can get notified every time I upload a new video. So for today's ingredients, we need salt and pepper, one medium chopped onion, a big can of sardines, one carrot, thinly sliced cabbage, one egg, four cloves of garlic, two tablespoons of flour and some green onions. Sardines are actually rich in vitamins and minerals. Now let's separate the sardines from the sauce. A small serving of sardines once a day can provide up to 13% of the recommended daily allowance value of vitamin B2 roughly one-fourth of niacin and about 150% of the RDA vitamin B12. Now that they've been separated, let's reserve the sauce for later cooking or for later use. And now we're going to break them or mash them, but we're not going to take out the bones because the bones are high in calcium. And for today's wrapper, we are using Vietnamese rice paper, but it's the Thai brand because I ran out of the lumpia wrapper and that's all I have in my kitchen right now. I always make fresh vegetables with boiled chicken every week, that's why I have these on stock. Did you know that sardines are also a natural source of omega-3 fatty acids which reduce the occurrence of cardiovascular disease? Recent studies also suggest that regular consumption of omega-3 fatty acids reduces the likelihood of developing Alzheimer's disease and can even boost brain function. Hmm. They're also a good source of vitamin D, calcium and protein. I know, I know, I talk too much. Okay, now let's mix and make sure it's well blended. Let's not forget the salt and pepper. And of course, let's mix it well again. And for the rice paper, we need to soak it briefly on both sides in lukewarm water. Now let's start wrapping. So this has a different texture from the usual lumpia wrapper because it's not firm, it's soft. So we'll just repeat the same procedure until all the filling is gone and wrapped. It's also a bit tricky wrapping with the rice paper because it's sticky.
So I'm going to fry them in sunflower oil in medium heat. And flip to cook evenly on both sides. Now our sardin spring roll is done. For the dip I made it with fish sauce, lemon, vinegar, sugar and small red chili peppers. But you could also have the spicy sweet and sour sauce. The texture of this spring roll is really different from the usual spring roll that you would order in a Chinese restaurant. It's also crispy depending on how you cook it but at the same time it's also soft if that makes sense so after all these lockdowns are over when you want to throw a party this could be one of the appetizers and it's really good I really like it I'm actually having it with Bacardi Coke while watching TV it's really good oh I love it so guys watch out for my other upcoming videos because I'm gonna share different recipes using sardines with you I hope you like this video and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell button so that you'll always get notified every time I upload a new video. Okay guys, I'll end the video here and see you soon.